enjoyed this episode of You Be the Hero, brought to you by Yubi. School supplies cannot move on their own. Special effects have been added to animate the school supplies to create the effect of simulated powers. Activities in this series were done under adult supervision. Please do not attempt without consulting with an adult first. Hi, I'm Natalie the 17-year-old founder of the international mental health organization, Soli Sunshine. Do you ever just bottle up all your emotions and they build up and build up and build up until you just want to smash? Yeah, I think we all get a little like that sometimes. One really great way to take a mental break is through art therapy. Hi, Mr. Larry. Hi, Natalie. Thanks for coming on today. Thanks for having me. I'm really excited to talk about art and our emotions. Me too. I am super into using art and my creativity to express myself. So I have a few questions for you. Are you ready? Absolutely. Let's go. What inspired you to start creating? I come from a really creative family. My mother likes to draw. My dad likes to draw. And so it was always encouraged at home. So I spent a lot of time making drawings and paintings and exploring every kind of creative thing I could find. I love that. My family also does a huge arts and crafts project for Valentine's Day where we each make Valentines for each other and draw and paint. So I understand the connection that you can form with your family. How does art positively impact your mental health? Sometimes getting your emotions out on paper or on a canvas can help you understand them a little bit better. Sometimes they can help you see new things about the way that you're feeling. For instance, when I was a lot younger, I dealt with bullying sometimes and making artwork and expressing myself there allowed me to get over some of those feelings that I was having. I think bullying is definitely something a lot of kids like you and me went through. And so using art therapy as a way to overcome that is a really great idea. So how can our friends at home get into art therapy? Well, one of the great things to know about art therapy is that anyone can give it a try. You don't have to be an artist. You can try your hand at painting or drawing or even just using coloring pages whenever you feel like you might hulk out. You can make art in your home or you could go outside in nature and you could try stacking rocks or doing leaf rubbings. Anything is possible and you can be creative in a whole lot of different ways. Wow, it sounds like anyone really can do art. Thank you so much, Mr. Larry, for coming on to talk to our friends at home and me about how they can express their creativity. You are super awesome. Wow, he's such a great artist. Now I'm inspired to give art therapy a go. A great thing about art therapy is that you can do it no matter what level or artistic abilities you have, and it is a great way of expressing yourself. I'm gonna download a coloring page and try doing some art therapy myself. Ah, okay, so I'm back. I got my coloring page. I got some art supplies. Now I'm ready to get started. I'm getting really into this. So while I finish, let's check in with our friends making a school supplies donation. Hi, I'm CJ Matthews, and this is my little sidekick. I mean, my little brother. Hi, this is Calvin. And we're Blinks for my buddies. We're here to deliver a UB classroom pack to a deserving teacher in a kindergarten classroom. Who's ready to see my masterpiece? On the count of three. Three. Two, one. How cute is this? And I feel so much calmer. Definitely more Bruce Banner than Hulk. Make sure you like and subscribe for more content to help you be the hero.